uh, very little movement for him. He'll have to switch from uh, about middle and leg across to off stump, I reckon. Oh, that's got to be out, yes. Plum LBW. And that was the one that darts back from outside off stump, off the seam. Had the impression it didn't get up all that much either. Well, it got up enough, but it would have hit about halfway up, right in the centre of the middle stump. That's a bit closer. Yes, he's given in. Peter McConnell is in the game. And he signals that Imran Khan is LBW to Terry Alderman. Final breakthrough. Imran's not happy. Let's have a look at the replay. He's very close. The ball pitches on middle. And, well, it probably was going to hit the leg stump, I'd say. And Peter McConnell raises the finger. That's a dreadful sight. Another big appeal for LBW. He's got him this time. The batsman not happy about it. Well, I tell you what, Alderman is a real magic man when it comes to LBWs. He gets them so regularly, and that is largely because he gets so close to the stumps. Four sips, short point, short leg. It's close. He's got him. Yeah, it's a good change. That looked very close indeed. Uh, playing back, Alderman strikes. A great piece of captaincy by Alan Bonner. It was indeed. And when you're in a situation where you need just a couple of wickets and you're not getting them, you've got to keep changing your bowlers around. It's exactly what Alan Border did. And I think the fact that Waka Yunus played back to that one left Peter McConnell in no doubt. Big shout there, and he's given him. Umpire McConnell has given the fifth LBW to Terry Alderman. And uh, Akib Javid is not amused. The ball certainly stayed very low. It wasn't, uh, it wasn't going to go over the top of the stumps. So five LBWs to Terry Alderman, six in the innings altogether. And Australia have wrapped up the first test match by 92 runs. That was a marvellous game of cricket from uh, two very, very good teams battling away.